Hey guys, if you're here and I went and I'm talking about the ESRB. Now, for those who don't know what that is, that's the American rating system for games. Basically, they have to rate a game before it could even be like released and sold within the US, I believe. So, apparently, over in Japan, Cero, which is their rating system, C E R O, has closed down until at least May 6th due to COVID 19. And with that happening, they, they aren't able to rate games, which means that game companies have to wait until they rate them, I believe, before they can even come up with a release date. Because I believe if sometimes a game trailer comes out and they're like, this product is not yet rated. But usually, if they give a release date, they have to have it rated. So people seem to be wondering whether the ESRB would follow the same suit and close down. Well, apparently that's not what's happening. They're going with a different approach. Instead, they're working remotely, I guess, from home, and they're still working to rate games. And apparently there's been no delay on rating games so far. So this is good news. It's good that the SRB is still rating the games so that they can still come out when the developers and I guess publishers want them to come out. So it seems like, at least in the US, we won't have delays on games due to the ESRB. And I say due to the ESRB because we are going to have delays, obviously. We already had delay with Last of Us Part 2, and I believe there's going to be other delays due to COVID-19. But in any case, it's good to see at least no game should be delayed because of the ESRB, since they found this new way to work remotely and rate games remotely. Definitely, though, God willing, this thing will pass really soon and everyone can return to their regular business lives within the recent foreseeable future, I suppose. Anyway, what do you guys think about ESRB, unlike Cero, not shutting down their doors, but still rating games, even if they're doing it remotely? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and subscribe. May God bless you all.